Hi, my name is Jay Bickerton. I'm the editor or director of Broadcast Sport and Broadcast Tech. And I'm Max Miller, senior reporter on Broadcast Sport and Broadcast Tech. We look after two successful and highly regarded television industry awards, the Broadcast Sports Awards and the Broadcast Tech Innovation Awards. Winning one of these awards is not only a brilliant achievement, it recognises you as an industry leader, attracts new business and is a fantastic marketing tool. To maximise your chances of success at the Broadcast Sport or Broadcast Tech Innovation Awards this year, we've laid out a few handy hints and tips. These are in no particular order, but I'll go first with tip number one. Keep your entry simple. Use straightforward language and focus on what sets your entry apart from the competition. Avoid unsubstantiated hyperbole and where possible provide facts and figures, data and insights to back up your claims. But most importantly, always ensure your entry is clear and easy to understand for our team of industry judges. And for tip number two, create videos to showcase your entry. Make sure you submit a video as part of your entry and always ensure it relates directly to what's written in your entry form. Judges are looking to see your video showcase examples of what you've talked about in your entry form. It's essential you do this, as judges can only judge your entry based on the information in your entry form and your video. So make sure your written submission and video work together to maximise your chances of grabbing the judge's attention. The next tip is to ensure you say what makes your entry special. It sounds simple, but not all entries do this. Without using flowery language and long paragraphs of over-exaggerated benefits, simply explain why your entry stands out from the crowd. Back this up with relevant facts and figures and video clips that directly relate to what you've written on your form and you're on your way to being shortlisted. The fourth and final tip is very simple. Don't ignore the word count or the eligibility period. The word count is there for a reason. Maximise the opportunity you've been given to explain the great points about your entry by fully utilising the space available. Don't miss any key features that will help get your entry a place on the shortlist. And, it's an obvious thing to say, but please check the eligibility period for the awards because if your project wasn't produced or broadcast during the eligibility period, it won't be shortlisted. Right, that's it. I hope these tips were useful. Wish you lots of luck with your entries. Yep, good luck and we look forward to seeing you at the awards parties for the Broadcast Sport and Broadcast Tech Innovation Awards later this year.